on board, here board. Let's get this over with. <laughs> well, look who's here. New recruits? Well, <laughs> let's fuck some shit up. I regret to inform you that you have sadly not accumulated enough points. However, you did get hero points, so that is a plus. But alas, you cannot attend this academy. So good upon hearing this is all rage, just heartbroken as all hell. And he's terrified as soon as he hears a knock on his door and sees all might. He's thinking, okay. In that case, he just plucks out the hair and give it to all might. What's this for? You're here to get your quirk back, aren't you? No, of course not. I don't think I could get it back even if I did want it back. What? No, I'm not he here to get my quirk back. I'm here to console you. Oh, wait, but why don't you want your quirk back? Young Midoriya, I chose you to be my successor, and I stand by that choice. Though, yes, you don't get to attend UA, you can try finding another school, I'm sure. We'll be more happy to take you. Really? As Inko, she hears this, as they hear a shattering of glasses. What? Uh, uh, Mom? How much did you hear? Oh, uh, the whole point was you say, take my quirk, take your quirk back and whatnot. I heard that much. Clear as day. You gave my son a quirk? How? Uh. Well, damn. As the cat's out of the bag, and they had to explain to Inko what's what. I should have known. I should have known, but I was too stubborn and didn't want to. <sighs> All right, I may know a place. What? There's a place that I'll take you. You'll technically be law enforcement, but the work they do is out of this world. Why do you say it like that? No reason. As yes, Inko contacts a, a friend of hers or two, and then Izuku notices uh, Miss Midnight. What are you doing here? Oh, my best friend called uh, called me up and said that she needs a uh, an application. All uh, oh, my, what are you doing here? Uh, wait, are, are you shacking up with this boy's mother? Is that why he was the, at the entrance exam? Uh, oh wait, now that I get a good look at you, you do kind of look like Inko. Uh, 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 what? You know my mom? Well, yeah, though, yeah, she is a bit older than... Huh. <clears throat> huh? I'm older? <sniffs> Do I need to remind you, huh, of your childhood, or the one that you keep hidden? What are you talking about, Mom? 
Oh, Miss Midnight, you know, she's in her 30s, right? Yeah, I mean, I think I heard that somewhere. Well, it is dead ass wrong. Inko, what are you doing? Oh, no, I just think my, you know, my son is a, is a fanboy when it comes to heroes. In which I think it would be very nice if he knew more about you. Inko, please, think about what you're doing. Hmm? What? Tell him that you're actually in your hundreds? <laughs> what? Uh, no way. Always. Uh, uh. Did you find the fountain of youth? Inko. Well, since we want to go ahead and spill the beans on everything, why don't we explain that you are in your thousands? Cool! You bitch! Pot, meat, kettle! As they're going on and on, Izuku's looking at like, Is this really happening? Oh my, she's in her hundreds. As you can just hear the echoes of b boy and man fans starting to cry out in agony, but also curiosity. It's, yes, it takes 10 minutes before they calm down and things are broken, things are torn, and uh, midnight is okay, so what's this about the application and whatnot? And I want my son to join the GP. Really? Yes. With a quirk like his. Uh huh. Do you realize if he went all out, he could be. As strong as All Might, if not stronger. Do you really want someone that dangerous to join the GXP? Do, do you realize how much... Oh, wait. That's precisely why, isn't it? Yes, it'll be good training for him. I'm pretty sure he could still be a hero, possibly. Oh. Yeah, technically, but if anything, he's not here. What? Uh, yeah, you'll be a hero, all right. No joke, especially if you do your job right. But you, it's going to be different. It's going to be, uh, you're going to be a different kind of hero. You see, me and your mother used to be in law enforcement just before we actually decided to retire. Her becoming a housewife, from what I can tell. <laughs> me, I decided to keep up this good looking appearance and whatnot. And, uh, become a hero. And as you can tell from my fan base, I've done quite well for myself. In fact, the old lady here <laughs> I'm sorry what you hold, you heard me grandma <sighs> keep talking keep talking brat brat I'm sorry uh, did you forget your hearing aids I don't know. You're kind of mumbling. Did you forget your dentures? As yes, the fighting continues. This time it takes 30 minutes for them to calm down. And by that time, they're wearing the drapes. Not what I meant, but still. Ugh. If anything, so okay. Please explain. Them giving Izuku and All Might the whole rundown when it comes to the whole. Oh. Really? So, what you're saying is. 
aliens are real? Correct. And there is a force called the Galaxy Police in which they... Yep, 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 that's right. Are you serious? Mm-hmm. Quite interesting, isn't it? Oh, and you two used to be a part of it? Well, there are more uh, members than what you really think. Cause, considering that we actually live such long lives after our enhancements are fully completed, whew, we technically could have still been, you know, members. We just decided to have more quiet lives, or at least I did, as Inko, she just does some fiddling around with her watch, and she's Prime Inko again. Actually, she's, you could say, Prime, Prime Inko. As, yes, if she she could do a pass for midnight if she had a change of hair color and whatnot. As yes, this is when All Might has a bloody nose. This is like... Toshi! Oh my, I did not know you were such a dirty old man. <laughs> no, you don't get it. Look! As considering that she transformed like that, she changed, her clothes didn't. So they are a lot more constricting, you can imagine around certain areas. Izuku knowing he's like, no, that's my mom. I am I, I won't I wouldn't dare look. Naruri, she feels like I'm sure I can get a better reaction out of him. But as she looks at Izuku, this is like Oh no, I got a better idea. As then Naruri, she decides to do a little failing with her watch in which Oh, if you if you look prime prime Minko with all the curves and everything, plus the enhancements doing their work, yeah, Ruby looks a lot better. Only thing is, well, Inko got a reaction of All Might, Ruby got a reaction out of Izuku to the point where they're both carrying bloody noses. Ingo pissed, of course he would be, well, who who wouldn't, considering, it's like, young lady, if you do that again to my son, I will beat you down. I'm sorry, you're going to speak up, you still haven't found your dentures, have you? What? Oh, wait, are you... It's like you're missing your hearing aid too. Hey, it's not my fault. I can get a reaction out of your son. Now is it? <laughs> Listen here, you harpy. If you do anything to my boy, I am going to fuck you up. Happily. Oh, you're threatening a hero. Should I arrest you? All Might, would you like to... Is he still unconscious from the blood loss? Hmm. What do you think, Izuku? You like what you see, don't you? Him just... He's awake, but he's like, just Stay away from me. You're doing this on purpose. Like, you're damn right I am. It's fun to get get a one over on your mother especially considering she seems to have raised such a gentleman Inko she transforms back but then she goes into full on defense mode of Izuku saying no 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 you you thought wrong you thought what what, what? excuse me what did you call me oh it's like you're the one who needs a hearing aid. Uh, it's like old age is finally catching up with you. You're one to talk. Of all the people who... You're the oldest one of 
all of us. I'm sure your husband sure as hell doesn't know, now does he? He doesn't. Well, why not we give him a call and he, he can learn just how experienced, or at least how uh, long a life his wife has actually lived. How old are you? Uh, you're 1,000 something, 2,000, I forget. Mm. So help me God, I will bury you. Threatening a hero. Hmm, I can still arrest you, you know. It will be worth it as long as I rip out those implants. <gasps> Excuse me? What the, the fuck you say? You heard me. Well, I have you know these are 100% natural. Hmm, I don't know. I have heard rumors around the academy saying that you ha possibly had some work done. <laughs> really? I'm sure you were the one who started those rumors. For being an old geriatric. Just jealous of my youth. <laughs> jealous? Why do I have to be so jealous? As then Midnight just pushes Inko aside and hugs Izuku. And this is a hug you... If my mom saw a woman hugging me like this, at least an older woman who was taller than me, she would raise utter hell. She would be mixed, have mixed emotions from pri being proud of me, but wanting to kill the bitch. That's pretty much the whole uh, scenario Izuku's in right now. As he, and I said, like, come on, you like them, don't you? Uh, come on, speak up. <laughs> As he's looking up at Midnight, she has a very sedated look on her face, and he passes out due to that nosebleed. Oops. Inko just rushing to his side after shoving Midnight. He's like, Look, you done. I guess that was a little too much for him. You, you, I. You, why? These are none of this. Hey, it was your fault too. You're just as much to blame as I am. The hell I am. Do, do you really think? Just saying. As soon as you start talking about ages and whatnot, they they tell about my boobs. It, all it's no holes barred. So you start throwing shade at me, I start firing back. Mm, no rules. Why? So please call the hospital. Please, I am not losing my son after all this. You were just supposed to bring a damn application for him to fill out. I know, but don't forget what this is all your fault. <coughs> as yes, they are still going back and forth. As Izuku, he's woozy from the blood loss. <laughs> And I and Ingo are still arguing. Oh my, he's still out cold. Because hell, he didn't have much blood to really begin with. As yes, this is pretty much how it goes. Until an hour goes by. He's a goose time. like, okay, okay. I'm alive. Thankfully, somehow I am alive. So, was this about an application? <sighs> yeah. uh, if I'm going to be with you, you midnight, I'm going to need a plug. Someone to give me constant blood transfusions. <laughs> okay. 
hugging you like that. Yeah, that was my bad. I didn't have to do that. If anything, blame your mom for being such a rude guest, uh, host, or whatever it was. Is still well, doesn't matter. Application, please. Fine. Her just reaching down, and like, wait, where are you pulling that out from? Like, huh? Oh, don't worry about it. Her just handing it to me, like, don't you dare try, try to smell it. <coughs> Izuku covering his nose, like, don't, don't do that. He goes. I have proof of how old you really are. Do you really want to test me? <sighs> Whatever. As Izuka, he fills it out, hands it back to midnight, he's just like, I'm going to bed. Before I end up as drained as a vampire's victim. Goodbye. Just walking out. Men, I just looking down like, oh yeah, I completely forgot All Might's here. Mm. Don't worry, I'll carry him back to his room. Uh, okay. That's so. Your uh, son. Are you sure you want him to be a part of this? Yes. Weird. I never would have thought you would have allowed him to join us in the Galactic Police. I think it's crazy, but still. Hmm. Trust me, I never thought I would have agreed to it either. It's really crazy. But. Times change, things happen. Yeah. I miss them too. As that is how that whole interaction ends. Y'all must be thinking, what the hell just happened? It's like, it's me. Come on. You can't be surprised. <clears throat> Once it's the next day, Zuku is woken up to the sight of Inko, as well as her holding weight. What is that? Oh, it's your new uniform, dude. Really? Yes. So, this is pretty much where I'm going to be wearing? Of course. Huh. Okay, so what's this called? What's this place called? Yeah, don't worry about it. If anything, it's. I think it was technically a police academy. Oh, I'm the only police officer? Yeah, yeah, yeah. In a matter of speaking, yes. Is it? Are you sure I could be a hero like that? Of course. It's. I'm not gonna lie. It's. Not as safe as regular police officers, or hell, you know, it, it can even be more dangerous than being a hero, which is really what. Huh? But wait. It, I'm going to be a police officer where it's more dangerous than being a hero? Well... Well, yeah. Oh. Honestly? Truly. Yes. Oh, whoa. So it's like that. Yes, it is. 
but uh, don't don't worry about it. It's I don't want to lie. You say it's safe or whatnot. Uh, I, it's not really safe, but they should help you out when it comes to you know. It's am I? Could I die? Yes, yes, you could. But luckily, they do uh, give you some enhancements and things that would make you last a lot more easily, easily, and everything. What do you mean enhancements? You mean like you and Midnight have? Yes. So I'm going to be able to live well into your thousands or hundreds, yes. Oh. And thanks to these enhancements, your body will be a lot stronger, so you should be able to handle more of that quirk of yours. Oh. Okay, yeah. That, thanks. Thank, that's great. Yep. I really wish I it might have been better for you if you did join UA but who knows uh, are you sure yes good I'm trusting you well I I won't be training you. Um, someone else will. So you want to put your trust in them. It's then the end knocking the door and it's Narumi. Congratulations, you were accepted and I am here to train you. Ha. Huh. Yes. I'll be. He'll be studying right under me. Her wrapping her arm around Izuku's shoulders, like, having a devilish, evil smile. She's eyeing Inko. Like, <laughs> they, they're letting this succubus teach my son. Well, that's not nice. What's the worst? thing I could teach him. Her giving Izuku a kiss on the forehead in front of Inko is... <sighs> That's great! <sighs> I did think it was better for their, someone's elder to say... Mm. Elder. Really? Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's that's so nice of you. You, an elder, huh? Uh, mom, should I be concerned? No, no, of course not, dear. In fact, if she does try something. <sighs> there are ways of me finding out and carrying out the appropriate punishment. <laughs> Trust me, I would never do anything to jeopardize such a impressionable young man. You better not. Do not, I repeat, do not give me any reason to come out of retirement to check up on you and open up the cans of the Wapas. Or else there will be serious repercussions. Okay, and now that's done. And go just walking out. I was like, good luck, Izuku. 
midnight. Don't forget, I know where you live. As she begins cooking breakfast. Midnight, knowing that this is not a threat, it is a promise to not do anything uncouth to her son. It's like, okay. Now that's over. Let's go, shall we? As before they actually leave, Izuku's confused, like, okay, so, uh, is this where the school is? Oh, no, this is where our ship is going to pick us up. It's overseas? More like over the stars. What? As a spaceship comes down and picks them up. But this is right at the time when all my shows back up. Like, what's going on here? Like, Oh, apparently I'm going to space? Oh, oh yeah. Well, you know what? All my, since you were, uh, you know about me now, why not uh, you, we just go ahead and get you all fixed up? What? Fix that wound of yours. I mean, your respiratory system's all fucked to high hell, isn't it? Huh? We have doctors that can fix you. Is that clear enough? Move out of my way. And I'm just hopping onto that damn spaceship and they are off. Man, I send all my to the nearest infirmary and her and go uh, finish the registration and getting him fully enrolled. In which Izuku is for lack of a better word, a lot more. Okay, so this is it, right? Oh, trust me, you're gonna be learning a lot. But first, we need to get you all enhanced. What's that supposed to mean? Well, there's a reason why me, your mom, he looks so young because that's how we actually look though yes we do add some features like crow's feet gray hair even just to make it look like uh, we are actually aging technically we don't at least not anymore as much really Uh, that I know you saw something when your mom turned back into her actual form. That's what she actually looks like. Thank God she didn't look like that before. Why? Chances are I would have had siblings. Or worse. Oh. Oh. Oh, oh, no, 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 no. Believe me, I, 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 uh, though there are royal families that dive into that, no, I, I promise you, Inko, she's, she's, she's not one of them. If anything, what did you think about my real form? Did you like, it was like, it was like, him just looking in the eyes, like, She's not here, you can be honest. Maybe a little. Oh, that's precious. I, that's, a, that's a good answer too. Good, good. Just patting him on the head like a child. Huh. If anything, you could say Midnight is a pretty hands-on instructor. And so let's just say there's a time skip. In which, yes, uh, as things are per canon, uh, just without Izuku. But after whole all my being enhanced as well as fixed, not only was he able to completely demolish the Nomu, which is Shigaraki is terrified, he's enhanced to the point where he might not even need one for all if he loses it. 
I mean, he won't be 100, 100% of one for all, but very least, it's enough so he can still do some hero work for a while. When it comes to Izuku's training, he's been enhanced to the point where he can... Hmm, let me think. How strong was Sena in that anime after his first one? Well, let's just say he, he's 20%. He can use 20%. He hasn't unlocked Black Whip because, well, he, if anything, they'll worry more about his training rather than actual field work. Especially considering he needs to learn a lot more control when it comes to having one for all still. And which, after time passes, oh yeah, his first excursion into the unknown void of space does come with some uh, repercussions. He's not unluckily unlucky, or luckily unlucky, however you see it, but it's more random coincidences that he just so happens to run into pirates. Him spending time with Midnight, as yeah, the Hero Society is wondering where the hell happened to, what, where, where is she? It's the whole fact that he's actually gained more confidence, but without Bakugo there, pretty much being a complete asshat, and uh, Midnight having her being uh, one hell of a tease. Yes, she. Uh, Boosted his confidence in himself a lot more than it would be in canon. Though, yes, he is worried about what he can do to other people. He's more confident in how he can utilize his power. Even learning how to use one for all in different ways and aspects. Things like this. Considering that he actually does emit electricity, he always wondered what else he could possibly learn to do with it. Like, what if he tried channeling it some way, somehow, or absorbing it? Considering how much he was actually releasing when it came to the muscular fight, what if that was inside, like, full power, considering that one million percent, I don't think it was a full one million percent. It's pretty much like him... Expelling all that excess energy was what all that electricity was. But him actually absorbing it back in. That's when he, his strength is stronger than All Might actually begins to set in. So, yes, as you can imagine, Izuku is a lot better at this. Only thing is, he is, uh, he's not used to so much praise. So whenever he does this badge with those pesky pirates, everyone is praising him as a hero. Something he's wanted ever since he was young. Ever since he ever could ever believe himself to want to be a hero. He just got some validation. Appreciation. Sometimes that's all a man wants. Appreciation for what he, he does. No matter how small it may seem to you, you just say thank you or whatnot. Sometimes that can make a man's whole day. <laughs> Doesn't mean being an asshole to him right after, but still. So, yes, he's a who, upon gaining more experience, he does keep in touch with Inko and even All Might. So, All Might's hella happy about it. His progress. But one thing that Inko's wondering is how's he and All Might to really gonna do this whole he's the new pillar of hope uh, symbol of peace thing if all he's doing is pretty much in space. Which uh, they don't know. <laughs> Dude never thought that far ahead. If anything, All Might was like, just try another hero school. If anything, if Inko didn't hear a damn thing, chances are he's gonna go to the Shinketsu. <laughs> or something, so 
uh, that shit was for sale, so sorry, not sorry. Now, when it comes to Izuku taking lives, he has. Inko knows that chances are he's had to kill at least once. She wants to be there for him to comfort him, but I still got things to do here. But uh, Midnight assures that, don't worry, I got it covered. 